So I was thinking about doing something new besides putting all of my vinyl regularly in alphabetical order, archiving the videos you see more regularly. I also want to share with you all the stuff that comes in. Can be from digging, can be from buying online. I thought that was a new extra to this channel. Uh, will make the process of archiving also much faster because all those videos where I put everything in alphabetical order showing you all the vinyl and stuff um, in a way sometimes more stuff comes in than I organize so with this new feature on my videos you will be able to see what comes in and I will be able to put them directly also in alphabetical order here next to me in front of me some stuff that I found last week while digging in the city here it was a nice day it was really sunny so I went through all my record stores that I normally visit found cool stuff let's dive a little bit deeper into that hi I'm the hip-hop collector hiphopcollector.com so first up a super classic that I found in really nice condition an experimental fusion of hip-hop and jazz maybe some people already know what I'm talking about it's the legendary Jazz Metaz album rest in peace guru this one is like super super classic uh, I think I have it already but I found it in a really nice condition so I just grabbed it along you cannot go wrong with this one. I just put it on. It brings back so many memories. I think this is a re-release. I really need to check it again. But I could not leave this behind. Jazz Matas, Volume 1. Really, really dope. Next up, Conway the Machine presents Drum Work, the album. Super cool album. This one is still sealed. I don't know if I will leave it this way or if I will open it. Um, I listened this already many times on the streaming services. I really liked it. So I was happy to find this one. Cool. Conway the Machine presents Drum Work, the album. Nice. Next up, a super dope album. Um, which I adored from day one of its release. I remember buying it way back in the days on, on CD because that was my thing back then. Um, this is Brothers Doobie, Funk Doobiest. How cool is that? This album is phenomenal. I really adore it. I don't know if I have it already. This one is in very good condition. If I have it twice, I will put it uh, for sale on my website. By the way, I'm working on that to put all my doubles uh, for sale on my website. Coming soon. I will keep you posted on that. Anyway, Funk Dubious, super dope album. Listen to it last night. <sighs> awesome memories to the fullest. Funk Dubious. Next up, one album that I adore a lot as well. Which I found also last week and super nice. Accept Your Own and Be Yourself, the Black Album by No ID. If you do not know this one, go and check it out. Buy it, whatever. This is awesome. This is simply fantastic. So many great tracks to be found, this one. <sighs> Featuring Common, Duck Infinite. Wow. Dope. No idea. Wow, I really like this one. Such great beats on this one to be found. And then two uh, 12 inches that I found also. Uh, and I had to grab them. This one is too short. Pay style, 90.95. Super dope. 12 inch, too short. Can't go wrong with too short. And the other one, Follow the Leader by Eric B and Rakim, the 12 inch version. Awesome. Classic. Cool. These are the things that I found last weekend while digging in the city. 
super cool to find stuff in stores still a cheap way to find stuff no shipping you know what i'm saying i will do this more often then you at least see what comes in into this room what i found while digging while shopping online let's do this more often hope you liked it see you on the next episode peace